Howdy, folks. Welcome to episode fitting, as my southern friends would say, or some of them anyway. And yeah, we're going to do some construction today. So I wanted to make basically a kind of a spiral staircase down to the basement and, you know, make a basement, that is. And so I need, let's see, cobblestone as well. Do I have any? Let's see, do I have cobblestone? Eh, I'll just I'll just get what I got here. So we'll start here. And yeah, so instead of this thing, this ugly thing, I'm going to make basically a spiral staircase that curves down. And I've sketched out what I want to do so I can actually do it. And so I've got, let's see, one, two, three, and like this. And let me make some slabs here too so that uh, so that I can do this. Now I'm I'm just going to do cobblestone slabs right now for <laughs> to begin with because I don't want to basically I just need to lay out where what I'm doing and so I'm going to put these here and let's see when we're done when it's done I'm going to basically build it I think out of like nether brick and magma blocks and different you can make let's see here you can make nether brick red nether brick so it's kind of cool you can make red nether bricks that are a different color so i'm thinking the two of those together would probably look pretty cool plus all the stuff that we could chisel so yeah nether brick and nether rack should be should be pretty cool so this is going to be i'm just going to use slabs to go down the stairs and i'm not sure if i'm going to run into a cave down here as i'm going to but we'll find out so this is going to be three three and then like this and then this one is going to go here and then we're going to do a let's see that's going to go like that the next level so we'll take that out and we'll get this basically like a roof going up so this is going to be the next level and actually just so I can see what I'm doing I'll make this out of slabs there we go and so the next level is going to be let's see if we are on here this is going to be the W and the W is going to go like this so that's going to go up there and let me see here this is actually going to be closed in <laughs> so we'll put this back here and yeah like I said this is not going to be cobblestone when we're done so this is going to be two across and three and then two here so these okay and then we'll get this flattened out And I believe that's two more of these. So it's going to be like this. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. Okay. And then basically we're going to pretty much mirror that on the other side of this. So I, like I said, I got this sketched out. I'll put up a graphic of it so that you can see what I'm working with. I basically used a compass on some graph paper and then figured out what I wanted from there so we'll go let's see this is going to be like this and we'll put the cobble down here so we can see so we're gonna have this W and then facing this way is going to be the edge of the next piece and yeah, it's still funny. Okay. The, the splinters giving me damage every time. <laughs> I forget, but the game doesn't. <laughs> I forget that it exists, and then it reminds me. <laughs> okay, and let's see. We're going to take out this wall. And let me put down some torches, too. So we can actually see what's going on here. All right. Okay, so this is going to be here. 
And let's see, this will be blocks here and then slabs here. So this is going to be our stairway that comes up into the main room here. And like I said, the walls are going to be all decorated, so we'll put in nether brick. I do need to smelt all that stuff down. And why does this seem so thin here? This seems thin. It seems like it should be a block wider or something right here. Like this is just way too narrow. So yeah, it's not too short, it's too thin. <laughs> there we go. Let's see if that works. I think that works a little bit better. So yeah, I need to get this room hollowed out. Let's get the hammer going. It's hammer time. Okay. So this is going to be our portal room instead of that thing down there and then also like the nether wart growing room and all that stuff. And let's see, we'll get this going. So I'm going to get this room hollowed out and I will be back in just a minute. Okay guys, we are back and you can see here what I did was I hollowed out the room a lot more and I kind of round, rounded out the sides. Now this is going to be not the actual side, so we're going to put a shell around this of cool looking blocks. And also this is going to be, I'm going to put the portal, so the frame is going to be these 12 blocks here. Whoops. So yeah, I'm going to put the portal here. And that'll be, these blocks will be the actual portal. So we're going to, whoops, before I take the portal out, I also need to go into the nether real quick and grab some more nether wart, or not nether wart, but nether... Uh, soul sand is what, I'm, what I need. I need some soul sand. So I'm going to, because I'm going to line the outside of the room with soul sand. And use that to plant my nether words. Yeah, it was one of those creepy things. So let's take care of him. Huh, did he just drop? Did he just drop? He dropped a zombie head. Okay, that's funny. Yeah, those things... Those things... Yeah, they're creepy. They spawn on soul sand, so it makes soul sand uh, kind of <laughs> more dangerous than it already is with the being slow and everything. <laughs> it's kind of cool. It makes the nether more interesting. So, yeah, I'm going to grab some of this soul sand and real quick, and we'll see if we can get maybe a stack or a little bit more of it. And because we use this for making solarium as well. Now, the other thing that I need to do is I need to get some mining done. And the thing is, since there's not really any automated mining systems that are efficient at all right now, uh, I need to mine manually. And if I'm going to do that, I need, I need a fortune. And I don't have, because I've I've done minimal mining, so I don't have really very much lapis or anything. And so I can't really make, with, with the Tinker's tools, I can't really make a, whatchamacallit. <laughs> I can't really make a fortune tool. So what I'm going to need to do is pick up, yeah, we'll just take this thing out too. What I'm going to need to do is pick up a... Which we call it? Oh, is this not? No, that's not the right tool. I need an obsidian pickaxe. But yeah, I need to get an enchant table and use some of this XP that I've got. That reminds me, I can empty this out. Use some of this XP I've got in order to to uh, which we call it in order to enchant a fortune pickaxe, hopefully. And here we go. Here's our obsidian pickaxe. And I was looking at the chisel for the nether rack. And there's not really that much that's that interesting, so I think I'm going to end up just using the standard, the standard nether brick because this is all the stuff that's there. And I mean, I kind of like these, but I also like the magma itself, and I think the magma can be light emitting, which would be pretty cool to do as well. So I'm going to end up doing that instead. But yeah, we'll take this portal out. There we go, and. We can get rid of, or we can recover these blocks and make our own portal down there. 
And I'll get the rest of that off camera because that's <laughs> slow going. So we'll get, let's see, we'll put our obsidian down here, get the start of our portal. That's going to be here. There we go. And yeah, so there's going to be kind of, kind of a, a stylized archway or stairway or whatever going down into the nether portal. And then around the edges of this room are going to be, is going to be soul sand. So we'll put that here. And I think I want to do it this way. I'm not sure if I want to put it on the diagonals or not. I think, yeah, I think I'd like it on the diagonals. Whoops. So we'll get this going. And we'll put this up here. There we go. And then we'll put the nether wart on it so we can actually get some nether wart growing. There. And so then we can fill out the rest of it as this grows. And I'm able to harvest it. I can fill out the rest of this. And it looks like... I can put cobble in this corner as well, in these corners, since we're not going to be seeing that. So let me fill in these with cobble. Whoops. Nice. And we'll get this going. There we go. And then I'll need to get the nether, war or nether brick and nether rack over here. I've got, I've been smelting that, so let me get some more wood made up here. I've been using wood because it's easier to get than the coal for right now for the furnaces. So we'll get another rack here, or another bricks I mean. And so yeah, we'll get some of these, we'll do some of these and we'll also do some of the red nether bricks. So I need to actually, and I'll just do that as I go because I'm going to be making tons of this. And I'll probably end up also going to the nether fortress in order to get some nether brick. But yeah, did I leave anything? Okay, I didn't leave any spawnable spots down there. <laughs> Good. Okay, so yeah, let me grab some cobblestone here. And I can throw that in. And yeah, the magma, I wanted to see how the magma would look as well. I think that might look kind of cool on the walls as you come down here like every column or every other column or something like that make some magma here so let's see we'll put this here like that and on this side and did I just yeah I did <laughs> okay so we'll put this here so I'm probably going to need to go get more magma as well. But yeah, this is going to be, I think, every other. And I'm not sure if that's going to show up. Yeah, that's going to show up. Okay. So every other type thing. So we'll get that put in. And I'm, uh, like I said, I have to double check how, what, what the deal is with the the other little glitch block what the deal is with the light levels on the magma I think it's the there's something about they take on the light level of stuff around them and I think once you basically put something bright next to them they stay brighter or maybe you have to place them with a higher light level or whatever but yeah I'm gonna figure that out so I'm gonna fill this in and I'll get the floor filled in and is this already no it's only the first stage and I'll get this portal put back in and I will be back in just a minute okay guys we are back and here we go I've got the magma put in and the nether wart is at least ringing the room now it's not all fully grown yet but I'll be able to get some of that and get this brick going the portal is in and I'll need to decorate something around that but you can see what I'm going for with the pillars here and apparently the it's a bug with the magma that basically when you do this and you light it and you break the torch it's supposed to not keep the light level but it looks like if you watch here it's lighter now it's darker it's lighter now it's darker so i don't know if that bug is still actually happening or what but anyway that's all the materials i've got for right now so i'm gonna have to go get some more materials wait for this nether growth 
nether wart to grow and so that I can make the red nether brick to do the floor and everything. And that's all the time we're going to have for today anyway. So join me in episode 16 and we will try to finish up this room and probably get an enchantment table going. So we will see you in episode 16. Later.